Get others to do the work for you, but always take the credit, is the seventh law of power in Robert Greene's book The 48 Laws of Power. Welcome to my series on The 48 Laws of Power, where I tell you about the timeless principles outlined in Robert Greene's best-selling book. Use the wisdom, knowledge and legwork of other people to further your own cause. Not only will such assistance save you valuable time and energy, it will give you a godlike aura of efficiency and speed. In the end, your helpers will be forgotten and you will be remembered. Never do yourself what others can do for you. This law is all about leveraging the skills and expertise of others to achieve your own goals while still taking all the credit for it. When you get others to do the work for you, you free up time and energy to do other important work or projects. So how can you apply this law to your daily life? First, identify the areas or the specific job that you can give to other people. Look for people who have the skills and expertise to do these tasks and empower them to do their best work. This would be, for example, if you run a store, you could hire someone to work the cashier while you do the other important stuff. Second, make sure to communicate your expectations very clearly and uh, provide the necessary resources and support for the tasks to be completed successfully. Third, give credit where credit is due. Acknowledge the contributions of others and show appreciation for their hard work. This will help foster a sense of teamwork and collaboration. Finally, don't forget to take credit when it's due. You worked so hard to do and manage the tasks, so it's okay now for you to claim all the success as yours. Remember, the seventh law of power is all about leveraging the skills and expertise of others to achieve your own goals, while still taking credit for the success. By getting others to do the work for you and taking credit when it's due, you can increase your power and influence. Thank you for watching. Bye.